Empress Wu Zetian, China's first and only female ruler. Lucky start. Wu Zetian was born in AD 624 in the Shanxi province of China. The Wu family was wealthy, and her father Wu Shihu was a chancellor for the Tang Dynasty. Unusually for the time, he encouraged his clever daughter to read, write, play music, and speak in public. Skills normally taught only to boys. Her father raised her to believe that women could do anything that men could do. Both bright and beautiful, 14-year-old Zetian was noticed by the Emperor Taizong, who invited her to his court and gave her the important responsibility of the royal laundry. One day, she bravely spoke to the Emperor, who was impressed by her intelligence, and he decided to make her his secretary instead. Even though she was young, she helped with important business of the empire, and Zetian was good at her new job. The ideal ruler is one who rules like a mother rules over her children. Empress of Heaven. The emperor's oldest son noticed beautiful Zetian too, and fell in love with her. After Taizong died, the prince became Emperor Gaozong. Even though he was already married, he loved Zetian, and they had two sons together. Gaozong's first wife. Lady Wang was furious. After Zetian had a daughter, the poor baby was found dead in her cot. Wu Zetian believed Lady Wang had killed her. Lady Wang was accused of witchcraft, divorced by the emperor, banished, then killed. Wu Zetian became the first wife of the emperor and China's new empress. Empress. Soon after, there was a huge earthquake, which many people believed to be a bad omen, proving that a woman should not rule. Her husband had 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 bad eyesight and struggled to read, so the Tian took on more and more of the work of leading China. When Gao Zong started calling her himself Emperor of Heaven, the Tian called herself Empress of Heaven. She knew that she was equal to any man. When Gao Zong died, the Empress made first her elder, then her younger son Emperor, ruling from behind the scenes. But when they did not obey her, she forced them to give up the throne, proclaiming herself Emperor of China. Ruling China with absolute power, she renamed the dynasty Tianzu, or Granted by Heaven, claiming that she was a divine ruler. She created new characters for the Chinese alphabet. Even the way people wrote could, would change under her reign. Wu Zetian was an extraordinary woman, attractive, exceptionally gifted, politically a salute, and an excellent judge of men, and polluted. And many things did change, often for the better. China had long been a land where many leaders were not trustworthy, lying and cheating to, to keep their powers. Power. Wu Zetian decided to end all of this. She started a system that, of spies so that she always knew what was happening. She fired many government officials, saving money and making the kingdom run more smoothly. She created a special box where people could send suggestions directly to the emperor. And she used many of her people's ideas, mark, making herself very popular. She changed the education system, hiring the best possible teachers and introducing exams so that all workers in the government or military had to prove their intelligence. She reopened the Silk Road to start trade with the West, bring mo bringing money to China. She proved improved farming and the lives of her people by lowering taxes and encouraging people to grow bigger crops. And she shared out the land so that everyone had a small, equal piece to farm. Shaking the world. Wu Zetian ruled for many years, and she was known by many names. But one thing is clear. She made China a fairer and more peaceful place. Although many historians have shown her as a ruthless, cool, cruel politician, she proved that women were equal to men, and that could rule just as well, or indeed better. Her two marker is blank, possibly, possibly because people were uncomfortable honoring a woman who held such power. Other stories says she believed her successes were so impressive, words could not describe them. While some people... She, while some believe she wanted her actions to be judged by later generations. Although her enemies accused her of many crimes, people now recognize many positive changes she made to her country and the lives of ordinary people. A portrait of Wu Zetian as an older woman. Goodbye!